Hello, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you the very old fashioned craft of baking paper beads. And this is a good craft if you have children because there's no glue gun involved, just scissors and paper and white glue. And that's all you'll need apart from a pencil and a ruler. And I'll show you how we do it. is good for this craft. You can use gift wrapping paper, you can use copy paper, any kind of paper, white or colored, and I've chosen to use tea boxes and also a file folder. Save any scraps that you have. This is a small piece off of a box, the rest had printing on it. It's all good. We'll start with the file folder and the first thing to do is to cut off the tab. I marked a line that was the width of my ruler and then I marked another line which was a diagonal which means every ruler width gave me two strips for beads. So you see you can get quite a lot of beads out of any piece of thin card or paper that you have around. You don't have to um, go out and buy anything special. Save your gift wrapping paper, that makes excellent beads. After you've got your strips cut, the first thing to do is to give the strip a little bit of a curve. So I always roll my strips first before I begin gluing. And I use, in this case, a paintbrush. Any kind of spindle will do. Here's what they look like after you've curled them. Okay, once you've done that, uncurl them again and then put some white glue, just plain old white glue, um, along the length of the strip. Be careful how you roll them, try and keep them centered because the taper needs to be right in the middle of the bead and you should end up with some really nice beads to make into garlands, um, jewelry if you like, bracelets maybe. Um, Christmas ornaments, they make great garlands for Christmas trees and just hang around with um, twine around your Christmas lights. Um, for any occasion really, Valentine's, um, parties, Easter, weddings, anything you can name, you can use a good bead for. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Please um, give me a thumbs up if you did, share with your friends and hit the subscribe button to see more of my easy crafting videos and thank you very much for watching.